In this video, I'll be helping you with the Alex problem type called factoring a quadratic with leading coefficients greater than 1, problem type 3. We're given a quadratic here and asked to factor. And since a method isn't specified, I can use either trial and error or the AC method. And so for this example, I will use trial and error. So I know that the factor form will resemble this. Looking at my leading term, I have a 21x squared, so we could say that that is either 1x times 21x or 3x times 7x. And then looking at the last term, I have a positive 12, so this could be either 1 and 12, 2 and 6, or 3 and 4. And it's important to notice that since that last term is positive, the signs have to be the same, but our middle term is negative. So this would either need to be negative 1 and negative 12, negative 2, negative 6, or negative 3, negative 4. So multiply to be a positive 12, but then combine to be that negative 32 in the middle. Now that I've written out all of the possibilities, I'll start by trying my 3x and 7x. Again, I'll start by trying the negative 3 and the negative 4. When I plug those in as negative 3 and negative 4, the way I can check is to see if that gives me the negative 32x. Whenever I multiply the inside, I get a negative 21x. And when I multiply the outside, I get a negative 12x. Those combine to be a negative 33x, but not a negative 32. That combination does not work. Before giving up on the negative 3 and 4, though, I should switch them and try this combination, negative 4 times 7x, negative 28x, negative 3 times the 3x, negative 9x, giving us a negative 37x. So again, not the negative 32x I'm looking for. This combination did not work. So I'll move on and try the negative 2 and the negative 6. And this gives me a negative 14 x and a negative 18 x and when you combine those this does give me the negative 32 x so this is the combination that works we have factored here by trial and error 